Hey guys, welcome back to Brunson's Math Club. Today's topic is how to simplify ratios. So what is a ratio? A ratio is the comparison of two numbers. And a ratio must always be simplified. So, ratios can be written in three different ways. They can be written as A to B or A colon B or A over B. Now let's say that we have the ratio 8 to 12. Okay, and now we need to simplify this ratio. So to do that, first we must put this ratio in fraction form. So 8 to 12 put in fraction form would be 8 over 12. Now we find a number that is both uh, divisible both by 8 and 12. So now we, we must find the HCF, the highest common factor. So let's find the HCF. To do that, let's list factors for both the numbers 8 and 12. Factors for number 8 would be 1, 2, 4, and 8. Factors for number 12 would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, and 12. Now we must find the highest common factor. So the highest common factor among these factors is the number 4. So now we divide both 8 and 12 by 4. So 8 divided by 4 and 12 divided by 4 and that gives us 2 over 3 which is 2 2 3 and that is our simplified ratio okay now let's do a word problem so now we have this word problem let's read it it says in a basket there are a total of 30 fruits 10 of them are apples and the rest are oranges what is the ratio of oranges to apples so remember when you're I'm um, doing ratio word problems it is important to read the question so now let's read the question again and it says what is the ratio of oranges to apples okay so they're telling us the order in which we'll write our ratios and that is oranges to apples so as you can see um, the question actually tells you the order in which your ratio should be presented so I'm gonna write oranges to apples so I know what type of ratio it is going to be so now here in the word problem it also says that there's 10 of them are apples and the rest are oranges so we know that there are 10 apples okay so that we know that there's 10 apples but how many oranges are there well if there are a total of 30 fruits okay and 10 of them are apples then all we have to do is subtract 30 by 10 and we get 20 so there are 20 oranges so it's 20 oranges to 10 apples so 20 to 10 now we must simplify this ratio remember to do that we have to first put this in fraction form so 20 to 10 in fraction form would be 20 over 10. Now we find the HCF of these two numbers. So the highest common factor. So let's list the factors of 10 and 20. So factors for number 10 would be 1, 2, 5, and 10. And factors for number 20 would be 1, 2, 5, 10, and 20. Now we need to find the highest common factor. And the highest common factor amongst these factors is the number 10. Okay, so now we go back and now we divide 20 and 10 by the number 10. So 20 divided by 10 and 10 divided by 10. And so that gives us the fraction 2 over 1 which is going to be 2 to 1 and that is our 
simplified fraction of 20 to 10. So using the ACF method is one of the ways to simplify our ratios. As you can see in our first example, we have 8, 8 and 12. And both of these are even numbers. So if we start dividing by 2 and keep doing it, we will get the most simplified ratio. And as you can see in the other example, we have 20 and 10. We can cut the 0 with the 0. Okay, so if we cut the 0 with the 0, we'll be left with 2 and 2 to 1, and that is going to be our simplified ratio. You can use any method as long as you divide the denominator and the numerator uh, both by the same number to get the most simplified ratio. Thank you very much for watching this video, and we'll see you guys next time in our next video. Bye.